I want you to let, your, let that image fill the frame of your mind. See the barrel? The trigger? The various components of the gun? See the colors and the texture of this particular pistol? Do you see? Imagine a hand gripping that gun. Four fingers wrapped around the grip. One finger hovering near the trigger. I want you to see it up close. Do you feel it? Like you can reach out and touch it. Now I want you to slowly zoom out on the picture of that. Pull back until you see the arm attached to the hand. Then until you see the shoulder attached to the arm. Pull all the way back until you see the face of the person holding the gun. Do you see the person? Whom do you see? Is it a police officer? A criminal? A soldier? A terrorist? Is it someone you know? A friend? Could it be a relative? An enemy? Is it you? Can you see what the person is aiming at? Is it a paper target? A bad guy? A good guy, again, is it you? In one sense or another, every participant in the debate over guns in America is fighting for or against the person holding that gun. If you see your grandmother pointing the gun at an assailant, you likely view the Second Amendment a necessary safeguard of a vital liberty. On the other hand, if you see an assailant pointing the gun at your grandmother, you like to see the Second Amendment as an unnecessary obstacle to public safety. When I campaigned for the Democratic nomination for constable in Austin's Precinct 2, some Democratic pundits wrote that my unwavering support for uh, the Second Amendment makes me unqualified to serve as a Democrat. <laughs> We need leaders who understand. 
understand that what opponents of the Second Amendment refer to as common sense is nothing more than a collection of prejudices common to people of a common background or a common life experience. America needs a government that views the Second Amendment not as a nuisance, a necessary evil, or something that must be downplayed and circumvented at every opportunity, but as a cornerstone of liberty and a guarantee of a basic human right that must be safeguarded at any cost. Your only choice on November 6th. 